Hey everybody, Anna from Pet Links here. Today I'm going to show you how to register a new pet to your profile. Go to petlinks.net, click login, username and password here. If you've lost your username and password, you can click here. And if you need to create a new account for free, you click here. Pet name. Okay, you can see that I've got four pets here, but I would like to add another one. I'm going to go down here and click register a new pet. I have two options. I can purchase a pet subscription online, which is what most pet owners will have available to them for $29. $10 for a 21 day trial subscription. And of course, everybody has a seven day free subscription option, which is especially useful for people who have just lost their pets. You also have a prepaid pet link subscription option. Here's the list of those. You may have a animal card. And if you do, here's what it looks like. And you want, here's what it looks like. And this is the number down here that you input. L-Y-N-X space, four numbers, space, four numbers. You input that here and away you go. You may have a pet links green tag. Looks like this. If that's the case, then you input those numbers here. You may have a code and you click on other coupon, input the code and away you go. Today I'm going to use a pet links tag number. So Continue. There you go. I am going to get a new cat. His name is going to be, her name is going to be Pookie. Her primary breed is unknown. She and it's 100% unknown. She's a female. She's spayed. Her approximate age is one to six. There's her tag number. I can also put in her microchip number, tattoo, another external tag, any description there, and a municipal license. Add a pet. Oh, primary color required. She's all black. Okay, here's Pookie. Now, I want to go in and make sure all her identification information is in there. You can see I've got seven different folders of information that I can input here for Pookie. These are her vitals. If I want to edit them, I can click here. This is her name, her description, identification. I can go in and put any unique markings, like uh, six toes, notch in the left ear, etc. If she's got a microchip, tattoos, collar, external tags, municipal license here. Breed. Care profile. Now this has a number of options. There's a lot of information that can get put in here. Anything that you would want somebody to know if they found your pet. So I want to uh, put in here any medical conditions she has, prescriptions, grooming details, travel, general information all the more information the better the contact information here's my name my phone number my email address if she were to be found even if I didn't know it even if I didn't know she was lost uh, I would receive an email saying we have found your cat relationships I can add a number of different relationships if I have my sister and I want her to also be linked to Pookie in case she's lost or found, I have my sister create her own free profile and then I add her here. I link her using her user ID. Of course, photos are good. So if I want to add a photo, I go here, add a photo and upload from my computer. 
That is how you register a pet to your profile. Go down here to my patterns. There we go. Pookie's now been added. She's safe and sound. And that's that.